Hey guys, we are back for another video. That was a weird hiss in the beginning. But today we are going to do um Treyarch versus Exo Zombies. Personally, I like Treyarch a lot more, but I'm gonna try to not take sides. So let's go. So first we're gonna be looking at the diff difficulty. Already there's a no-brainer that Exo Zombies is much easier. Later in this video you're gonna see that I get out of trouble. Like, I should have died. I just gave up. I gave up, and then I found that I wasn't dead. I could have gone made a smoothie by the time I got out. Like, seriously, it's so easy. If I was in Black Ops 2 Zombies and I got cornered like that, I would be dead. But, you're not going to see that for a while until, like, the end of the video, because I died at the end of the video, obviously. But, um, how about guns this map has some of my favorite guns in zombies history as in the crossbow thingy that shoots the balls and it bounces all over the place and the shotgun that shotgun it just dis destroy the haymaker <laughs> but yeah th this has some of my favorite guns ever but nothing can ever compare to the thunder gun in treyarch favorite gun gum my favorite gum it's my favorite gun ever and then there's the ray gun ray gun mark two paralyzer people say paralyzer is a noob gun it's an amazing gun it's amazing i love it i know i didn't mention the slicko fire but i personally just don't like that gun it's much too over like people think it's much better than it actually is the thunder gun does infinite damage okay the staffs don't get me started on those the bows i love them but they're pretty hard to make well the fire one um let's go with points now it's probably easier to get points in advanced warfare but everything costs more the the 3d printer the box costs a thousand as in in um black ops and black and this call of duty treyarch zombies it only costs 950 uh perks I think it would be better for exo zombies. I'm guessing because already it's super easy, and if you get perks, you're almost invincible. If you get all the perks you can possibly have, like exo reload speed cola, um, exo health, uh, uh, jug. But I don't know. I don't think there is. Wait, isn't it, is exo assault? No, exo assault is when you can jump in the air and smash. I don't know, but but. It's stupid because there's here's I'm just gonna go the uh, oh drops. As you can see here, security destroying uh, security is amazing, but my favorite is explosive touch, which I get later in it. Um, but yeah, like there's only really three good ones in Black Ops Two Zombies: nuke, max ammo, and double points. Nuke is like to get you out of trouble, I guess, and I just really like the nuke. Because it gives you 800 points if you have double points. But, yeah. Oh, I when I was at guns, I never said how good most of the guns are. As you can see in the gameplay right now, that gun is pretty good. But, it's a sniper. It's a sniper pistol. And the snipers in this game are terrible. So, yeah. Um, Black Ops 2 definitely takes the cake on this one. Black Ops 2 has amazing guns. M20 set. Black Ops in general. Black, there's the Haymaker, there's the H HVK, there's the KN44, um, I'm just going Black Ops 3 right now, M27, um, what else? There's the AK-47, AK-47 in um, Mob of the Dead, there's the AK-47U, there's the MP40, all these guns, amazing. But then Advanced Warfare just has its one weapons, and that's the only good part about the guns. Um... Let's go. Huh. I don't know what else to talk about. Just gameplay in general. What is more fun? I am just downright Treyarch on this. Treyarch has done amazing at zombies, but it really hasn't had focus on anything else. But seriously, zombies is so fun for Treyarch. Treyarch doesn't make it like you don't need, like in extra zombies, you need the exosuit to actually survive and get to a high round but in black ops 2 there is no exosuit there is no suit that makes you there's nothing you need you can just do whatever you want if you just want to get to a high round with n nothing but your pistol do it 
If you, but in advanced warfare, if you want to get high around, you better get your exosuit or you're dead. Um, what else? Also, the doors are ridic ridiculously expensive in um, advanced warfare. There's I opened two doors in, in a row that were 2,000 points. I could almost get pack a punch on Black Ops 2 in that amount of time. Uh, I, <laughs> I just stopped talking. Probably just like a fan base. The fan base. Black Ops Call of Duty Treyarch, Treyarch has a much bigger fan base. They've gone, been going on longer, but also they've they've they know how to make their games. They know how to like make a zombies game, but uh, Sledgehammer has never done it. We're still waiting on Infinity, Inf Infinite Warfare to see what Zombies is going to be like on that. Um, by the time this is out, Infinite Warfare. I, by the time I'm making this, Infinite Warfare isn't out. But, <clears throat> so, leave down in the comments your favorite. If you like Treyarch Zombies or Exo Zombies. Probably some people are going to say Exo Zombies just because of the Exo Suit. And that, what if you didn't have the Exo Suit? What if you didn't have the exosuit in um, Advanced Warfare? What would you do? Black Ops 2, you don't need any of that. Uh, huh. Wonder Weapons, let's go to Wonder Weapons. Black Ops, Trayer takes the cake easily. The staffs and the bows. They are amazing. Oh, you can't get... They are crazy. Let's go back to Black Ops 1, Thunder Gun. Let's go down to World at War, the Wonder Waff. PPSH is like a wonder weapon to me. Um, jeez. Like, you can't, there's nothing to compare with this, because the staffs, the, um, the bows, the, uh, Thunder Gun, and the Wonder Waff. There's a crossbow ball th throwing thing. There's a laser machine gun, and there's a shotgun in Advanced Warfare. I don't know if I'm missing one, probably, but those are the three that stand out to me the most. Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> like, there's no comparison in these two games. I don't know why I even made this video. To show off how good Black Ops 2. Yeah, the graphics are amazing in Advanced Warfare, but that's for the campaign. The graphics aren't that good. In um, Advanced Warfare, sorry. In Zombies, in Exo Zombies. And they're trying to stand out like World at War, how it was Nazi Zombies, now it's Exo Zombies. Stupid. Like. Black Ops 2, it's just zombies. Black Ops 3, it's just zombies. Black Ops 1, it's zombies. So tell me your favorite Call of Duty um, zombie game. Mine? Debatable between three, and you guys might know which three. Black Ops 1, 2, and 3. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Bronchitis. But don't go crazy in the comments because I have bronchitis. Um, yeah. Probably I'm gonna go Black Ops 2 because I have all of the maps for it and I've been playing that. That's I've been playing that much longer than any other game I've ever had. So there you go. There's my opinion. There's the actual comparison between between them much people see there there's explosive touch I, I was about to end this video but this is what I'm talking about Th I'm saying this is something good about advanced warfare for the first time in forever but yeah explosive touch is amazing I love it whenever I get it, I just run around when I got this in my record when I was recording this my eyes just went huge like oh, yes <laughs> okay yeah that's all we have for this video oh wait <clears throat> oh, uh yeah, there's the crossbow. But you can see this gun right here? It's a sniper. I'm not saying that's good. 
In Black Ops 3, they actually buffed up the sn snipers, and now you can actually snipe in that game. Like, the elo on snipers is amazing. So soon, um, I should get trapped in a corner. <laughs> um, but yeah. So tell me your favorite zombies game. That's not like Left 4 Dead, Call of Duty zombies game. I wonder if some of you are gonna say, um, World at War. If you do, you're my homies. I'm surprised I used the sniper very well. Like, I punched him. And then I got him. Just because I punched. Eh, reload. Do, 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 do. Oh, hey. Like, it's so easy. But I die really quickly, so. Just wait a second. Once I get enough to open this door, I open it, and then I get trapped. But when I get trapped, that's not when I die. I die because I get infected, and... See, I missed. Then that just turns into a machine gun, apparently. Right? Right? Wait. Right here, I get cornered. I just gave up. I'm done. I punch. I punched and I got through. Look at that. Look how easy it is to survive. And I'm not gonna die because of the zombies. I don't even have exo health. I die because of the infection. That's probably the hardest part about Black Ops 2 Advanced Warfare Zombies. And I'll s so that's all we have for this video. And I'll see all you guys in the next video. Bye. I'm an